Hello there. Um, welcome to the December edition of The Loop at the Armory, which started at our beloved Armory in Somerville as a live show years ago. And uh, since COVID, we've been bringing people in uh, online. We went online and uh, we've been bringing people in from all over the country. So tonight we have Ariel Silver from LA, who has some deep Boston roots. And she just came back from a tour this summer. Uh, and we have Marianne McAllister from uh, uh, north of Baltimore in Maryland, who's been making waves up here at the virtual open mics. And we have Nick Carter, an award-winning uh, songwriter uh, from Riverside, Connecticut, which is near Greenwich. So we, we're spanning the country, and uh, I'm happy to uh, uh, start out with uh, Ariel Silver. Um, and uh, so I'll remove uh, Nick and Marianne from the stream. and introduce Ariel. And I think I'll let her take it by herself from there. She's gonna do a half hour set. All of us will do half hour sets. And uh, we hope we can provide you with an entertaining e evening. So Ariel, here you go. Oh, there goes Rick. Bye, Rick. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, yeah. everybody. I am Arielle Silver. I'm an East Coaster coming to you from my little she shed in my Los Angeles backyard. And um, I've been in, a, I've lived in a lot of places. And um, this is a song, a lot of my songs are rooted in, in place, wherever it was that I was thinking about when I wrote the song. And this one is kind of rooted in my California time. A song called Miracle. Ankle deep in the Pacific, I sink my feet into the foam. Looking out on the horizon where the ocean touches the unknown. Hands and knees beside a tight pool Filling buckets for a mold And while my daydreams are drifting by You've built a castle with a moat Ooh, ooh, ooh. I call it a miracle You call it unpredictable art And maybe I'm more sense and sensibility Maybe you're more Star Wars and Disney spinning the teacups Faster and faster and I'm looking out for the belt of Orion Beyond the circle of airplanes flying You're up on LA stars, award show fashion Call it a miracle It seems improbable the chances When I think of space and time We even land in the same country You say what a lucky roll of dice Ooh, ooh, ooh. I call it a miracle Maybe I'm more sense and sensibility Maybe I'm more Star Wars and Disney spinning the teacups Faster and faster and I'm looking out for the belt of Orion Beyond the circle of airplanes flying You're up on LA stars, award show fashion Ooh, ooh, ooh. I call it a miracle you 
cause it unpredictable lots sense and sensibility maybe you're more star wars and disney spinning the teacups well, faster and faster and i'm looking out for the belt of orion beyond the circle of airplanes flying you're up on the lay stars of wood show fashion ooh, ooh, ooh. i call it a So, I was thinking when I wrote that song, I was thinking about this word I had just learned. There's a literary magazine out here based in Los Angeles called The Offing, and I had never encountered that word before. So I had looked it up, and, and it means that, that point on the horizon, especially when you're kind of looking out at that, that ocean and sky where that meets, and that's The Offing. And, and so I remember I was just sitting at my writing table uh, with my guitar thinking about that word, and the word didn't end up in the song, but the idea of it did. Um, so to me, that that's very much a, a contemplative kind of standing on the Pacific song. But um, for many years of my childhood, I lived in New Jersey. We moved there when I was in third grade, and we moved away when I was in 11th grade. But in the in-between years, we lived in one house. It was this uh, this tall house in the woods, and I was a, a, a fan of Little House on the Prairie at the time. And, and I, I often thought about, you know, maybe we had a little kinship because they had the, the little house in the big woods and we had the, the big house in the little woods. Um, and I lived on the third, the third floor of this house. It was kind of built into the side of the mountain, so the, the house got tall against the mountain. And I, I would look out on the, the treetops. And we had blackberries that grew wild in the woods there. My mom would go out and pick the blackberries. And I was thinking about the welts that she got on her arms and the things that we do that are really hard, um, but they're worth it for some reason. And uh, this is the song that came out of that. It's called Bramble Vine. Blackberries grew in the thicket, the north of our yard. In summer we'd pick them and come home with stickers and thorns in our arms. But some hours later, when supper was plated and served, For the pleasure that went into making dessert And some kind of love is like that A sweetness buried in a thorny patch Bramble fine, eaten time For my heart from the scraps Like making pie from scratch Some kind of love is like that. Someone once showed me the best way to work with the dough. Just a few presses, you crimp down the edges, then squeak the old oven door closed. Oh, finding a balance to strike between effort and ease requires some practice, a delicate lattice. You learn it degree by degree, and some kind of love is like that. A sweetness 
is buried in a thorny patch Bramble fine, eaten time For my heart from the scraps Like making pie from scratch Some kind of love is like that. Some kind of love is like that A sweetness buried in a thorny patch Bramble fine, heat and time For my heart from the scraps Like making pie from scratch Some kind of love is like that. So um, I lived in in New England for a long time, and um, I know it's dark there. I, I feel like I'm always kind of here in Los Angeles and simultaneously thinking of what time is it on the East Coast and and what is the light what what is the light quality like what is the weather like um, so the air, the light quality and the weather here in Los Angeles right now we're heading towards sunset and I know that you're fully in nighttime already in in the Boston area um, but it's not quite dark yet and and the squirrels so I'm sitting here in my she shed and just to give you a little sense of, of what it's like here I'm I have an orange tree that's right outside of my she shed window um, and there are just the beginnings of oranges they will they will spend the winter time ripening and uh, squirrels like to take flying leaps from the the sh the shed roof onto this orange tree so I've been <laughs> watching these squirrels as I'm as I'm playing if I close my eyes it's because I'm trying not to watch the squirrels um, sometime before the pandemic happened um, a friend of mine said um, she said um, of all of the things we we can control about 20% of them and other people get about 20% and the rest of it is just asteroids and chaos. And then the pandemic hit. <laughs> and this is the song that came out of that. It's called Asteroids and Chaos. The hearing room in Lowell. No she sheds here, but we have a chicken coop. Wow. All right, this is Asteroids and Chaos. An asteroid is coming I read it in a magazine It's gonna come incredibly close Tall as the Empire State Building Chaos on the doorstep I tell you we should hide Stockpile jars of jelly Clean the sleeping bag Stock up on wine You say this could be our big chance hot glue and cardboard boxes together we can build a rocket we can launch a rocket to the sky or we can dig a cellar to hide in maybe we just strike a balance unroll the hammock hold each other through the panic maybe it's a profit with a prize hark the herald angels sing it when the rocket the cosmos sways us, love will save us from asteroids. Oh, talk about chaos. There we go. Get those fingers on the right strings. The 
pasta shelves are empty. There's panic on the news. I'm crying in the front yard. Thinking about everything we'll lose. I hear music from the house. You swing the windows open wide, raised to crystal glasses. Say today you pour in the good wine. You say if this is our last dance, then let's not waste a minute. If I get one wish, baby, you're ready. We can launch a rocket to the sky. Or we can dig a cellar to hide in. Maybe we just strike a balance, unroll the hammock, hold each other through the panic. Maybe it's a profit with a prize. Park the herald angels singing when the rocket, the cosmos, sways us. Love will save us from asteroids and chaos. While we are alone together, I know what might make us feel better. While we are alone together, I know what might make us feel better. We can launch a rocket to the sky. We can dig a cellar to hide in. Maybe we just strike balance, unroll the hammock, hold each other through the panic. Maybe it's a profit with a prize. Hark the herald angels singing when the rocket of the cosmos sways us. Love will save us from the asteroids and chaos. The asteroids and chaos. Asteroids and chaos. Ooh, 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 ooh. So, asteroids and chaos. Um, Actually, I think I'm gonna, if I have another capo around here, there it is, um, I think I'll play one of my, a song that was kind of inspired by my years in Florida, and I, I've, I've realized after many years how much I, I um, write about place, and I have a new album coming out next year that I've been working on. Um, the album's called Watershed, and um, the title of the album comes from this song, uh, which is um, called River Dock at Sunset. Um, but when I was in the recording studio and I sang the word watershed in this song, um, I, th I was just thinking about that word and the idea of watershed moments and uh, how most of these songs had been written during the quarantine while I was sitting here for many, many days, months, years now um, in the little she shed writing songs. And I was thinking about watershed moments, but uh, a lot of the songs are, um, a lot of the songs are, also inspired by woodsy and watery places where I have lived. Um, and as I turn that idea of watershed over in my mind, I realize that I don't know enough about the watersheds of North America, those really important ecological systems that sustain us. Um, and so I've gotten really interested in reading more about the watersheds of North America. And, and really the origin of that interest is, um, is from this song. It's called River Dock at Sunset. On the river dock at sunset Beneath a crayon box of sky Last moments being supervised Cameras pinned us down like butterflies We clipped flowers onto dresses Coupled off against the chill Cusp of honeysuckle summer evening Every word we spoke full of meaning On the river dock at sunset The ones who taught us how to stand 
Reminiscing over rubber soled shoes Wondering how we got to heels and hairdos And constellations turn Above the river that keeps flowing by Time on earth keeps slipping by There's a difference between keeping something safe And helping it to grow On the river dock at sunset Through the lands of passing years Half between leaving and lingering We try to learn how to love without worrying And constellations turn Above the river that keeps flowing by Time on earth keeps slipping by There's a difference between keeping something safe And helping it to grow Helping it to grow On the river dock at sunset Along the worn and weathered boards Nothing's meant to stay But still, letting go is the hardest drill And constellations turn Above the river that keeps flowing by Time on earth keeps slipping by There's a difference between keeping something safe And helping it to grow Moments like the waves of the watershed On the river dock at sunset The river dock at sunset So I was on the East Coast um, for about a month last summer, uh, teaching in Boston for a writer's conference and then, uh, and then touring from Maryland up to Maine. And it was such a wonderful, wonderful time. And I just want to give a big thank you to Rick Drost, who, um, you know, kind of took me around, took me by the hand at Falcon Ridge Folk Festival and introduced me to people and kind of showed me the, the landscape. He even set up a tent. He lent me his tent. He set it up. Um, and I really just felt so well taken care of. He, uh, he told me all about the, the late night tent singing and, and told me where to go. And Rick, um, thank you so much. And then uh, at the end of it all, um, gosh, we were we were just talking and and I think we were either having coffee or we were talking about having coffee, um, uh, but it, at the end of the the time when we were saying goodbye, he said, "Hey, you should come and, and play this live stream that I host or that I'm a part of," and I was like, "For sure!" And so here we are, all those months later, finally doing it. It's the holiday season now, in case you didn't know. Uh, Hanukkah is coming up in a couple of days, and Christmas on its heels, and. Uh, the holiday seasons at times are very joyful and at other times can be really lonely and, and difficult. And this, this song came out of one of those years for me when I, I, many years ago when I was going through a breakup at this time. It's called Lonely Time of Year. There's something about the carols there's something about the booze that makes me think I got nothing left to lose. Cause the Yulok's burning brightly, but I'm here on Christmas Eve, thinking maybe it's time for me to leave. And every station's playing, I'll be home for Christmas. How the melody once filled me with good cheer But with every glass you pour I feel more sorrow In this house it's a lonely time of year I hung up borrowed stockings from a hook above the hearth 
Wishing the year would end with a fresh start But there's tinsel on my suitcase I hid the mistletoe Well, maybe it's time for me to go Every station's playing I'll be home for Christmas How that melody once filled me with good cheer But with every glass you pour I feel more sorrow In this house it's a lonely time It's an icy two-lane black top My wallet short on cash I always have a reason of holding me back While the snow falls like confetti I'm weeping on the tree Cause the truth is I'm longing to be free And that star up in the night sky That's shining through the snow I think it's telling me It's time for me to go and Every station's playing I'll be home for Christmas and how that melody once filled me with good cheer But with every glass you pour I feel more sorrow You may be home but you're never really here And in this house it's a lonely time I'm just trying to follow in the footsteps of, of my Jewish uh, Christmas songwriting um, comrades. I think that might have been all the all the time we have. Uh, somebody, let me know if I if I have time for one more song or if we should pass the buck. Um, and meanwhile, meanwhile, maybe I'll just start noodling uh, while I wait for the, Certainly the sign. Certainly, time for one more. Oh, oh, there's si there's time for one more. I hear yeah, you, Rick, time. in my ear. Wow, I didn't know that you could talk to me in my ear like that. Um, well, maybe I'll, I'll finish with this one. This is a, a love song. Um, and uh, I was thinking about, you know, it's it's good to come out of this side of the pandemic writing love songs about the person that you've been shacked up with for the, all this time. Um, and, uh, and I did. And I, I was sitting around with my guitar one day and I realized I'd never written a song about the first day that we met, that fateful day that I met my sweetheart. Um, and as I was playing this song... Um, it's called Worth Waiting For, and of course when I wrote it we were all in quarantine and the first time I performed it in, in front of a live audience in a venue, I thought, oh, this is also what I what was worth waiting for. So it, it sort of has both both feels to me. It's, it's going on the new album, it'll be out next year, and it's called Worth Waiting For. Stepped out in silhouette, a barefoot glowing, sounding out my name. Laughter and chatter, a splash poolside band began to play. And what can I say? And baby, you're not a fallback, a rebound. Distraction, no flash in the pan. And baby, you're not a trinket, a trophy, a token to show on my hand. You are everything worth waiting for.
Underneath a canopy of branches A shadow stop of light of sun It's gonna take my whole life To show you, you are the one And you are the one Cause baby, you're not a fallback Rebound, distraction, no flash in the pan. Baby, you're not a trinket, a trophy, a token to show on my hand. You are not the bottom of a bottle, a charm bracelet bubble tangled with stars and a horse. You're not a sweet drink, a Ferris wheel fling. You are everything. having me here in your live stream group and for listening. Hi, Rick. Hi, thank you. Hi, thank all, you. All great songs and so good oh. to hear you again. Uh, thank you. And uh, hope to see you again soon. I know. Uh, I hope to frolic around Falcon Ridge with you again next oh, summer. Oh, yeah. We'll, we'll see if we get there. <laughs> An asteroid Dave? hits us. <laughs> <laughs> right. All we could do is take care of the 20 percent. Right. <laughs> right. <laughs> and we'll hope. do what we can. <laughs> yeah. Thank you so much. We're yeah. going to bring up uh, uh, Mary Ann McAllister. So we'll say goodbye to Ariel. Let's see how I can do that. And bring Mary Ann into the stream. Oh, there we go. Where'd she go? There we are. Hi, Marianne. And let's see. Do I hear you? Well, hey. do you hear me? There you are. <laughs> I unmuted Great. too, so that always helps. <laughs> Sounding good. All right. And uh, I, I met Marianne, I think, through somewhere down in New Jersey. But uh, she's been up at uh, Art Grossman's open mics uh, uh, frequently, virtual open mics. And I even missed her when she was up here um, uh, in person. And we love Marianne's songs. So uh, I'll let, uh, and there's a little bio posted on the, uh, on the event somewhere. But I'll let her introduce herself a little bit. She lives in the, Nice, nice hill, hill horse, horse country, country north of Baltimore. And uh, we're very glad to have her. So I'll drop out. Should drop out. Ah, that's it. Okay. 
Well, hello, and Ariel, that was beautiful. I almost like to say, take another half hour, and I'm just going to sit back and enjoy this. But um, I guess that wasn't the plan for the evening, so here we go. Um, I live in a log cabin in a community called Sparks, and I was here for a year before somebody mentioned that maybe that was living dangerously. <laughs> I didn't even get it for the longest time. I like to do a mix of things, so you'll hear mostly covers tonight. Um, this first one, I like to just go into it. It got added uh, recently, and um, well, here we go. tonight. The other things I've done, we're going to take it in another section, and we're going to go from the Partridge family to John Rutter and Shakespeare, because that's just the natural evolution of things, I suppose. Um, this is Blow, Blow, Thou Winter Wind. When I was in high school, which was in the 80s, 70s, 80s, 80s, um, we, uh, I was in this uh, special choir, 
And we did this arrangement of John Rutter's uh, Blow, Blow Thy Winter Wind. Most people will um, hear this setting against a different melody. It's a beautiful, but I like this one better. And love this for so much. And I encourage anyone who hears this, if you get a chance to go on YouTube and pull up Rudder, Blow, Blow Thy Winter Wind, and hear this choral orchestral arrangement. It's sublime. Um, I loved it so much. And then I thought, well, is there a way to do it with just voice and guitar? So here it is, a pared down version. So there's a bit of mixing it around, and um, this will be something that kind of cuts between the two. Uh, it's Canadian Sunset, 
And I had so much fun adding this into the uh, uh, repertoire of things. Um, I, I think of it, it's hard enough to think of Dean Martin and the Martini and the boo 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 boo. And it's like, it's a great song, um, even if I'm not uh, having that mindset of it. Canadian Sunset. How else can you get a bossa into the winter season?
are we doing here for time? 7.51. It's getting close. I'm going to get this one in. Um, this is my original piece um, to include for the night. I wrote this in um, 2019. Yeah, yeah. 2000. The 19 threw me there, but it's in the right part of the year lineup. 2019, um, a lot of things were happening, and um, people were making choices. It's the season of waiting. It's a season of lights. So it's kind of a Christmas song, but it's yeah. it's waiting in the darkness, the whole solstice thing. It's called Lucky Enough. This season's waited with waiting. The night start earlier and lasts longer too. Meets us best in the darkness Comes as a baby That our faith might be renewed Each year you follow traditions Some things you hang on to Or it's just not the same Sometimes you add a new name or two Sometimes there's a grief of a face not looking back at you. We look at the lights in the evergreens glistening. We look at the lights in the children's eyes listening. Windows and houses welcome and beckon. Are you lucky enough to look inward and see such a light in yourself? The season starts in excitement So many ideas and things to do The days get shorter and you're running out of time Don't you see that's just life and the choices that we choose We look at the lights and the evergreens glistening We look at the lights in the children's eyes listening Welcome and back on. Are you lucky enough to look inward and see such a light in yourself? Here's what I wish in this season that your heart can see light in what you choose to do. Love doesn't have to be a zero sum game, and if we love and live right, no one has to. time for one more. Um, this is a Frank Lesser song because he wrote such beautiful things. And in my own way, I'm kind of ending the same way I started. Um, this is called What Are You Doing New Year's Eve? And um, kind of the same thing as I think I love you, except um, with some cooler chords. So here we go.
maybe I'm crazy to suppose that I'd ever be the one you chose out of the thousand invitations you received. Thank you so much for Rick, um, all the gang at the Lou for letting me do this and join this lineup tonight. And I'm just going to have fun sitting back now and really enjoying the rest. Of, <laughs> really enjoying the rest of the night. Thanks so much. Thank you so, so much, much, Mary. And I can't can't yeah, wait to uh, uh, the next time I can I hear you hear online or in person. And uh, lovely, lovely songs, songs, all of them, well sung. It's been a pleasure. Uh, Thank you. We're going to uh, move on to Mr. Nick Carter, and uh, let's see, I'll get uh, Mary Ann, say goodbye to Mary Ann for now. Wow, those songs will stick with me. Um, <clears throat> and I'll bring on Mr. Nick Carter. Hey, how are you? Good. I want to say before we move on to my set, Marianne, I loved what you did. I loved the work you did. I liked the uh, the Brazilian touch of that third piece. And I haven't heard anybody cover John Rutter uh, so nicely. So very, very, uh, very interesting stuff. And what are you doing New Year's Eve? I, you know, I'm always I always learn in these situations from uh, from Ariel as well. And now from you as well, just watching how you do what you do. And um, what are you doing New Year's Eve is going to be added to my repertoire. So thank you for playing it so nicely and so elegantly. I mean, if some people cover songs and you think, ooh, I'm not even sure I care about, but you played it in a way that drew me in. I love it. And, um, and 
Let me just say one other thing. I, 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 it, when a cover is done in an original way, and you don't need to hear me do this because you guys are all pro musicians, just like I want to be and such. But um, I think I love you. You know, you got it going. And I thought, I've heard this. I know this. I know this. And then you moved into it. And I said, of course, it's the Partridge David Cassidy tune. But the, the thing is, you know, first of all, you know you played it beautifully because you, you've worked the song. But I just want to say that it was a pleasure to figuring it out. It was like, this is really cool. And I know, oh, OK. So kudos. If your effort was to put a spin on a beloved cover, mission accomplished. So anyway. I'm glad I got to be here with you guys tonight. What a treat. Rick, thank you again. Well, thank you. Um, and, uh, and I'm just going to okay. make sure I cancel my echo cancellation. Okay. Uh, I just yeah, yeah. And I'll, 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 I'll check, check because that's a new thing. I've got to, okay. I've got to learn. Thanks to Mark. Mark. So, so we'll, we'll see you, Marianne. Marianne. Thanks, Thanks again, again for a lovely, lovely set. set. Thank you, Marianne. Wonderful music. And Ariel, I love what you did as well. Love the range of the songs, especially Lonely Time of Year and Worth Waiting For, two beautiful pieces from Ariel, so. Okay. And, and here we go, uh, from, from, oh, wow. Well, well. let's, let's, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, so you were, were uh, uh, here, here. Edit it. It, um, Mike Mike Mom, Mom, echo, echo cancellation, cancellation is off. off. Yep. And, and that's, that's what, what we, we want. want. So, so I'll just, just uh, uh, I'll, I'll just, just introduce, introduce you briefly, briefly and, and let you and your songs take it from there. I, I, I uh, met, met uh, Nick in person, person. finally at Surf in North, North Carolina. Carolina. In a song, song circle, circle. and uh, I was I aware of him because he's been active in winning contests up in, up in Maine, Maine, I think. So, so um, like, like, like in his, his songs, songs and approach. approach. So, so here, we, here go. we go. Here's Mr. 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 Nick Carter, and I'm going to get out of the way. way. All right. Rick, thank you very much. And uh, Mark, great to have met you tonight as well. Ariel and Marianne, once again, I, I uh, feel very fortunate to be able to be here and hear your great collection of work. Um, I'm in the company of some real wonderful songwriters. It's a pleasure to have met you both tonight. This is um, a song that was uh, kind of born on the shores of Lake Champlain a number of, number of summers ago. The wind was really... Uh, humid and warm and strong out of the south and running up the length of the lake and it reminded me that morning I was walking along the beach and it actually reminded me of a of a uh, moment a long time ago on another lake over in Maine um, on a, a moment with um, with someone with that someone uh, I always like to say I'm still dating her um, anyway, this is called Wind from the South. We were barefoot on a blanket And I wanted to chase away the doubt At the water's edge you leaned into me I still can taste the chocolate on your mouth Wind soft and warm as a whisper And the radio singing us to sleep And there's you and the stars and nighttime guitars Reeling all the years back in reach just below the surface, we feel our way along. Eye to eye, too right to be wrong. It's a sweet summer fire, no water can put out burning brighter. Mm -hmm. Like the wind from the south. 
How we loved when no one was missing Guilty of the sweetest kind of crime And those stolen scenes You'd reach for me And I'd play the thief every time Just below the surface We feel our way along And eye to eye too right to be wrong it's a sweet summer fire no water can put out burning brighter with the wind from the south i keep a picture from the day we got married and we're grinning like we found the inside track and the clothes look dated but the moment never faded and we're sure not looking back just below the surface we feel our way along eye to eye too right to be wrong and it's a sweet summer fire no water can put out burning brighter with the wind from the south sweet fire no water can put out burning brighter with the wind from the south sweet fire no water can put out Burning brighter with a wind from the south, sweet fire, no water can put out. Burning brighter. Mm. Mm. Wind from the south. Um, that song um, is um, a song that um, is uh, a special one to me. This, um, um, this song that I'm about to share with you is called Handrail in the Dark. And like a number of songs that... that uh, get written during the pandemic. You write them then and um, maybe they have a different meaning at a different time when things like the pandemic fade into the past. But uh, given what the world has endured even now, this song still has pretty special meaning for me. I basically think of it in terms of rescue and recovery. Handrail in the dark. Just tell me you're okay. I think I know what happened here The roof is caved in on your life And your heart got caught in there And you're on shaky ground But before it all comes crashing down Let me help you pass the broken glass safe and sound and when worry blind your heart and your faith falls apart and the night hits too hard I'll be your handrail in the dark and take you where you never be make a brand new start Never afraid again In the dark Just reach across The space between us And I'll be there Your handrail in the dark mm. 
We'll build promises into living things and put up a home of stone and stories we believe and we'll meet in the middle and we'll get rid of the riddles and we'll leave breathing room for when we disagree blind your heart and faith falls apart and the night hits too hard I'll be your handrail in the dark and take you where you never be make a brand new start never afraid again in the dark just reach across the space between us and I'll be there Your handrail in the dark You say you'll never be the same But love still knows your name And let me take you where you've never been Never afraid again in the dark just reach across the space between us and i'll be there your hand rail in the dark i'll be there your hand rail in the dark oh yes i will i'll be your hand rail in the dark mm -hmm. Um, the uh, the songs I've shared with you are uh, tracks off an album called uh, Nick Carter Fountain Pen. It was released on September 23rd of this year, and it's a uh, my debut effort in the contemporary folk community. It's a community that I'm new to, and so I'm I'm learning every time I sit with uh, talented folks like Ariel and Marianne um, tonight, and in other occasions uh, on the. Um, in the world of contemporary folk. The album uh, did make some charts, uh, radio charts in October, and I'm grateful to report that. And, um, uh, you know, some of the songs are getting decent responses out there. This song um, is on the album. It's the last uh, track on the album, as a matter of fact. It's called Rumble of the Train. And um, it's... Um, <laughs> We don't start songs until we correct our low E string. We'll get that back into tune. Um, I used to be, um, uh, where I used to work in Manhattan. I used to have uh, a corporate job. And uh, to get to that job, I had to take the trains, uh, the downtown trains from Grand Central to um, Financial District. In any case, uh, there was a very, very talented a player there named Wendy, and you could hear her before you saw her. And uh, that's because she was a fine musician, but also because of the hard tiles and the uh, hard services in Grand Central would carry the echoes all around. And so in the tunnels of Grand Central, you could hear her before you actually walked on a little stage area where she played. But this is for her, for Wendy, and for everybody who's ever busked to take commuters out of their rush and just give them a little sanctuary in a song. This is called Rumble of the Train. So I follow her voice underground And I had no choice once I heard the sound She was singing by the turnstiles to city on the run She was handing out pieces of her heart In every song Singing way down here Something's never changed 
I'm talking about music and the rumble of the train. Yeah. Well, she's there each day when I come rushing by. She says, I'll trade you a story for your time. Well, the world's an endless procession, but she serenades the ebb and flow. She might wish we'd all pay attention, but never lets it show. She just says, y'all come back, cause good things never change. Talking about music and the rumble of the train. What's reliable and real It's the way the music makes you feel And the rhythm of the ride that takes you home Or take me home Now if I just stop and listen to her songs the music stays with me all day long, but I gotta go. So I drop the tin, gotta leave again, and keep my day on track. Without a word, she smiles. We both know I'll be back, cause it's way down here that something's never changed. Talking about music and the bumble of the train. I'll tell you way down here, something's never changed. I'm talking about music and the rumble. Music and the rumble. I'm talking about music and the rumble of the train. It, um, it's interesting in the subway system, all the different kind of music you hear. And that song is dedicated to a woman who's pretty for unforgettable down there. I hope she's well. Um, the um, the uh, album has a song on it. Um, that I had the pleasure of co-writing with a friend named Kent Agee from Nashville. And uh, this song is called Comfort in Your Cup. And it reminds me of a friend, um, a lovely uh, person named Angie, who used to run a diner in the Connecticut area of Connecticut where I used to live or still live. And uh, the bottom line is she was so good at making you feel so welcome. And as I finally worked on this song, remembering those years ago when I used to know her, I couldn't help wondering what her day's like, right? And what she might say to you if when she comes through the door after taking care of the world and the diner, who's looking after her? So this is imagining what she might tell you. Yeah, I was born here Guess I live here all my life Sat right there in that booth at senior prom Made that satin dress myself You can probably tell But I felt like something special with it on Now that boy said he loved me Sitting right where you are now Swore he would get us both away Well, he got away all right And I'm here every night Making tips that I spent yesterday And I'll pour comfort in your cup And hear your story Though you're only passing through 
Sometimes it's almost enough to know that everybody feels the way I do. I used to tell myself I'd turn around some night and see him smiling as the jukebox played our songs. But I knew better than that He's never coming back So I buckled up my heart And carried on Pouring comfort in your cup Hearing your story Though you're only passing through Yeah, sometimes it's almost enough To know that everybody feels The way I do You know that boy, he called just the other day Said I was his best chance to get love right I told him he could have tried that line On the girl he left behind But he ain't gonna find her here tonight But it was comfort in my cup doesn't even matter if it's true Sometimes it's almost enough To know that everybody feels The way I do Yes, yeah, sometimes it's almost enough To know that everybody feels The way I do Yeah, I was born here Yes, I live here all my life um, The first track on the album, Fountain Pen, is a song called Guitar Is My Compass. Uh, uh, Rick, how, how am I doing for time? I don't want to overstay the set. I'll assume I can keep going. Just send me a high sign. One more? Okay. Very good. So if we're going to do one more, then I'm going to switch tracks. Um, actually, no, we'll go with uh, Guitars My Compass. Actually, no, we won't. We're going to go with the title track. The title track is called Fountain Pen. And um, I think it probably speaks for itself. Please don't hate me for the word she makes me write. She's been talking to herself all night Her trembling hand is steady now Thoughts come in clear And she's leaving you one last souvenir I am her only fountain pen The birthday gift you gave her back then and I can't count the time she's picked me up and put me down But she's writing rain tonight The way the ink is pouring out And her words say you are out of time And they lay across the page like a field of mines And no way out between the lines I can't stop her from writing it's the end I am just a fountain pen Like a jet black arrow flying from her hand I signed your names the day you traded wedding bands An Italian summer postcard, the late night letters back at school Notes of devotion by two crazy loving fools But tonight she's asking how it all went wrong 
drawing lines straight to all you could have done and question marks and margins laying heavy so cold one exclamation point closing in to take its toll and a word say you are out of time they lay across the page like a field of mines and no way out between the lines and i can't stop her from writing it's the end i am just a fountain pen her pain is out of hiding she can't take it anymore and the ink from my lips draws you a goodbye kiss then she packs me in her suitcase and pins the letter to the door whoa Say you are out of time. They lay across the page like a field of mines. And no way out between the lines. I can't stop her from writing it's the end. I am just a fountain pen. And I can't stop before it's over the end. I am just a fountain pen. There you go. Thank you very much, Rick and well, Mark, for making this possible tonight. Nick, wonderful, wonderful songs. songs. Oh. Thank you. Wow, I'm just the fountain pen and the minefield. <laughs> That uh, great, great, great imagery. And, Thank you. Uh, so we'll look forward to seeing more of you too. Um, well, I was delighted when I got your invitation a few weeks ago, and uh, uh, really uh, enjoyed being here tonight. Thanks for thinking of me, and I would love to come back. Good, and you know, uh, <clears throat> oh, here we go. Mark is announcing that you're live tomorrow evening from 6 to 8 in Vermont. That's right. Six to, thank you, Mark. That's kind of you to do that. Yeah, we have a, it's a um, in, in 30 seconds or less, I'll just give you an elevator pitch. That's a uh, album release party for Fountain Pen. And Seth Glear, who is my producer on that album, will be with me. And we'll be playing for two hours, bringing the songs of Fountain Pen to life once again, along with a few covers. So. Thank you, Mark, for playing playing that notice. Appreciate that, or putting that notice up there. Well, thanks, thanks so much, Nick, and uh, we'll see you soon. We'll look forward to it. You're next, I guess, hey? I guess. Wow, how do I follow all that? <laughs> I am so blessed to have uh, uh, so many great performers in. In, in my life and to be able to bring them and happy to be able to share share them with you uh, uh, so uh, everybody can hear them as the commander <laughs> boy I'll start with a little uh, are we all set? Let's see. I'll start with a little uh, aspirational love too, called Just a Song. <coughs> oh, do I have it? Yeah, have it. Everybody hear everything? Okay. Uh, 
It's the first crackling I've heard. I'm sorry. What's going on? Let's see. I get a little more loosely, I guess. Here we go. Just a song. If I were the sun, I'd wake you gently with my rising, peeking in the space between the shade and window frame. As the day moved on, I would bronze your skin and streak your hair Turning highlights orange, shadows deep I'd light the moon as you fell asleep And if I were a cloud and and you were lying in the clover I'd put on a show for you In puffy white and blue If I were first I'd be a bear Then a lamb and then a lion a spreading oak, a towering peak, finally a heart for you. But I am just a song, <coughs> and I hope that you will hear me, my melody delight you. If I were Coquelicot, one of seven thousand poppies, and you walked down through your meadow to the quiet river bank, I would pray that you, my chatelaine, as you came back up the hillside, would choose me for a vase upon your table. Well, I am just a song, but I could visit when you're sleeping. Show you plays of light and shadow You never knew you felt within Sun and cloud and flower and bird Would melt with ancient memories You could sing the song the whole day long dream in your sleep again we would sing our song the whole day long dream the dream in our sleep again Thank you much, just a song. We'll go a cappella for the next one. A while ago, <laughs> ooh, 
more than 50 years ago. I was just out of college, uh, and the family went to New Orleans. An uncle down there, uh, who worked in the Merchant Marine, showed us all around all the good, all the good uh, places. The beignet, the ferry boat, uh, some restaurants. Just before he left, he said, "Oh well, I can't let you leave without." without showing you the, the chicken play in tic-tac-toe. go, what? I've never seen that. Um, and um, so he took us off to a, a, a bar a couple of blocks off Canal Street dive bar. And way in the back was a big, uh, a big glass case with a the top of it had a chicken and a tic-tac-toe board with lights on it. He says, you aren't going to beat the chicken here. Take all the quarters you want. So we uh, put quarters in and watched what happened. Uh, uh, the chicken would play first and, and I'd play. Uh, I'd play and then make a play and uh, well, I did pretty good. I think the chicken won once, and then, but the rest of the time, tied. I couldn't get, the, I couldn't beat the chicken, and uh, so my uncle was right. And he, he would, the, the chicken was guided by lights, and he would peck at a light, and his ex would appear, and the little corn came down to shoot every time he pecked up the right light, and he ate the corn, <coughs> and went on. <coughs> and I thought, just out of college, well, I hope I can do a little more than that with my life. Um, but that chicken stuck with me, and it stuck with me, uh, well, more than you can imagine, I guess. Uh, more than I could imagine, because when about oh, about when I was uh, ready to retire, started thinking about that chicken in my life. And I got this song, Tic Tac Toe Chicken. I'm an honest working chicken in the tall glass case in the back of a bar where the merchant ships come in and the men come in and they have a beer and shot come back to play the chicken show each other what they got we play tic-tac-toe and we'll never win cause they gotta beat the chicken and they'll put their quarters in I play the X's and they play the O's I'm a chicken playing tic-tac-toe it's my move first, and a little bell rings, and a light blinks in the center, and I back at the light, and my ex appears, corn drops into a bin. I eat the corn, they play there, oh, we go until I tire when my life might be circumstantial scribe but the torn is good and the coop is warm at night so as long as I keep pecking at the light I'm a chicken playing tic-tac-toe now I work nine to six in a gray cloth cube pushing pixels on the screen for the company and the mail comes in as a little bell rings saying have can you have a look at this for me so i dig right in changing black to white and white to black till it works all right and another bell rings saying thanks great work now i bet you you can fix this one for us by tonight so i'll skip lunch maybe later catch a bite cause i have important things to do pushing pixels in a gray cloth cube Now I'm walking down the avenue, staring at my phone. 
a little bell rings and it might be alike if i like them maybe they'll like me i'm building up my virtual family conk and horn scowling people they'll just have to keep clear i'm following my friends to anywhere but here Pascagoula, Walla Walla, Istanbul, or Rome, I got the whole world in my hand. I'm tapping out likes on my phone, pushing pixels in a gray cloth cube. I'm a chicken playing tic-tac-toe. I'm a chicken playing tic-tac-toe. Thank you much. Got to check this. Let's see. Oh, yeah. That's what I was going to do. Got to switch guitars here, sorry. That goes all the way down. going on. There. Okay. song I haven't done in a while. I was introduced it as a song of, uh, of letting go or, or not. pictures on the wall. A bowl of pinned up souvenirs upstairs in a forgotten room. I'd passed them by these many years I thought I might go through them Here a steeple draws my eye Toward sky scrubbed clear with cotton clouds The pilgrim church where you and I Would read our poems, say a vow Next, next, a portrait on great stairs with family, friends, and flowers. If we had doubts, we didn't know it. If we knew, we wouldn't show it. San Francisco, San Marco, pigeons in your hair. Running down the beach with gulls, you're almost in the air. Next a stride a cannon in a fort in Nova Scotia. Elysee, Galatoire, Ocean City bumper cars. 
Pacific tides would pull you. I tried but couldn't hold you. No picture when you said you've done your best. I just can't stay. No picture when we loaded full your wagon for the west. I rode with you to Omaha, kissed you on your way. One more fall. Here's here's the postcard that you sent from Reykjavik last year. Traveling with new family, found contentment now I hear. In your mother's town, now no more steeple in the square. Clapboard, yew trees, bulldoze down, just concrete condos there. Pacific tides would pull you. I tried but couldn't hold you. No picture when you said you'd done your best. I just can't stay. No picture when we loaded full your wagon for the west. I rode with you to Omaha. Kissed you on your way. One more photo on the sofa. This one I might keep. Velvet Elvis dogs got you all curled up in a happy heap. That was then, and then was golden sheaves of love and laughter. That was then, and this is now. And now reopens after all. With trembling fingers, one by one, I'm tearing down these pictures from the wall. <clears throat> Pacific tides would pull you. I tried but couldn't hold you. No picture when you said you'd done your best. I just can't stay. No picture when we loaded full your wagon for the west. I rode with you to Omaha, kissed you. Thank you much. That was pictures on the wall. And uh, oh, we got to do a little bit of retuning here, but not much. Let's just. The song uh, came out of a dream a couple of falls ago. I had gotten on the train in Providence, headed west. There ain't hardly any more to go east. Um, but I didn't know where I was going. And this line came to me. Um, this is the first song on the album, uh, 2017 album, Turning the World. I'm hoping I got one more, one more album in me. We're working on it. 
<coughs> New Year's don't remember train. I'm sorry. I don't know what's wrong. <sighs> Try again. Here's uh, don't remember train. Guitar's too loud. One thing. Let's do something different. Here's a song about capturing little miracles, and counting your blessings. Little ode to meditation. Time now, time beckoning. Time out of memory glimpses of dreams not yet dead reborn romance second chances past reckoning the future now now is repaired here at the high mark where all waters rise before they start falling away. Widen the moment in front of your eyes. You can dance through all time in a day Lamb in the oven and cinnamon Ginger in the songs from your grandmother's heart Easter time, family gathers for dinner. Take your place till they're ready to start. Early this morning, out under the apple tree. Drops a dapple in sun. Cidery air up to blossoms, cerulean. Grandfather's blessings begun. At a still point, and you yearn to stay, but the world turns and it.
it slips away Gone now the apple tree, long gone the family, raised in the home that they built in its place. You ride to the strings of a loopy calliope. Reaching for brass rings they no longer make But you're finding apple trees everywhere now The forest in new fallen snow Above beach cliff towers in Tuscany, cradle them and let them go. In the windlessness, on a canyon. Breathe the sky down in and again before each dip of the paddle, each flick of the pen as God writes your name in his hand. There, at still point. Uh, thank you very much. It's uh, hmm. it's about time. I'll bring everybody back into the screen, and we can say good night. Add to stream. Add to stream. Boop. There we go. Oh, there's Mark. Where's Nick? <laughs> Where's everybody going? <laughs> Wait a minute, and stream. There we are. <laughs> there you are. <laughs> hey there. And hey, uh, yeah. Mark, the guitar is a, a Raymond Kraut guitar. I saw your I saw your question after I finished the set. Sorry. Oh, don't be sorry. I was just curious. <laughs> wow. Well, what a nice show. How blessed I am to have these songwriters in my life, uh, and uh, happy to have had the chance to meet them as I moved around the country and Mark thank you so much for your uh, keeping up with the chat and uh, <laughs> My pleasure. And handling uh, uh, so much of the so much of the stuff you're hired <laughs> we'll, we'll be in touch we'll be we'll talk uh, thanks Marianne for a wonderful thought Ariel's going off to teach her yoga class and Nick, uh, we'll, we'll see, see you soon you again. I look forward to it. Okay. Right. Good night, everybody. Thanks for listening. Um, Thanks CD for coming out. Uh, oh, thank you, Linda Marianne. Will be, Linda Marks, Marks, Marks will be running the next loop show in January. So, uh, lovely right. really set, Rick. Really nice. So, yeah. Yeah. Yes. yes, sweet just music. Lovely Rick. evening. Of lovely music. images in your music, Rick. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you much. Okay. okay, well, well nighty, nighty night. night. And let's see, we can remove ourselves or... Just push that big red button. <laughs> I'll just go one, two, three. Good night.